Hey there, Vicky. Hey, Maya. Whoa. Did you get a lip ring? Oh, this old thing? Well, getting it didn't hurt as much as you think. All you'll need is a trusty stapler, like this one here. Don't worry, she's not going to staple her lip. Use the end of a stapler or a stapler remover to snag a staple you find lying around. Now, find something round that you can press the metal on to smooth out its shape. Ah, there we go. Okay, Vicky, what do you want to pierce today? You know, I've always wondered what I look like with a nose ring. See? You can just stick the staple on top of your skin. No permanent holes required. Just gotta let my hair down and channel my inner bad girl. I love this thing. All right, girls, start posing. Another day, another boring outfit. Ugh. I don't have time to go shopping, so I guess this look will have to do. Hey, girl! Wow, you look fabulous! Where did you get that top? I'm going to lunch and all I have is this boring t-shirt. Do you think you could help me style this outfit? Please? Alright, I'll help you out. Start cutting from the bottom up on the front of the tee. Oop, not too far. Now, cut up the sides along the seam to the armpits. Next, flip up the flaps onto the shoulders and cut horizontally under the folds of the back of the shirt. Cut the piece you just removed in half vertically. If you have glue handy, go ahead and put it along the bottom edges of the two cut pieces. Now press the edge evenly onto the flipped up fabric pieces. Easy so far, right? After the glue is dried, grab the scissors again and cut it into a V shape like so. Cut slowly to make sure it's even. And on to the other side we go. You did it! Now put your new tee on and tie it in the back. Um, if this isn't stylish, I don't know what is. And you didn't even have to step foot at the mall. This is a win for sure. Admit it, you couldn't have done it without me. Yes, girl. Thanks. Move, people! Princess Vicky has arrived! No pictures, please. Whoa, we've got a case of a bunchy dress on our hands. <sighs> That's better. Ugh, this thing keeps creeping up my legs! Okay, let's try this again. Mmm, this mango drink is just what I needed on a warm day like this. Wait, seriously? Again? This is a midi dress, not a mini dress. All right, three layers of hairspray ought to do it, right? Wait a minute. If this stuff holds my hair in place, what else can it do? If your dress creeps up like Vicky's, try spraying your thighs with hairspray. Let it air dry for a few seconds, then pull that skirt or dress on down. Yes! The dress finally passed the test! Time to go for a walk, girl. Where is she? The movie starts in 20 minutes. There you are! And looking hot. Wow. Ooh, I take that back. Yeah, those socks have gotta go. I mean, why bright pink, Vicky? Way to look wacky, girl. I can't be seen with you like this. This is against the laws of fashion or something. Okay, this calls for some delicate surgery. Her socks, not her toes. Way to be dark, guys. Okay, Vicky, let's hand those suckers over. Here you go. Take the socks and make five small cuts along where the toes go. All right, see that? You'll put your toes through those slits, okay? Hmm, weird, but I'll give it a try. As you slide your feet through, place your toes through each hole. Huh, nice pedicure, Vic. Check it out. You'd never know she was wearing socks under there. Well, now we know who to call in a fashion emergency. Thanks, Helly. Better hurry up if you want to catch that movie. Can you relate to this woman? She's confident and knows how to get what she wants with that killer smile of hers. 
But in today's day and age, there are two types of women. They're either put together and poised like our girl Emily here, or they're a little more, uh, down to earth like Olivia. Neither one is better than the other. These two types of girls are just a little, well, different. So we're asking all our ladies out there, which girl are you? Perhaps you're the kind of girl who'd rather prepare a beautiful meal than order delivery. Yes, it's finally six o'clock. And that means it's time for pizza, baby. Why slave in the kitchen after a long day at work, when you can have dinner dropped off at your door? Ooh, it smells amazing! Meanwhile, Emily is still chopping away. Hey, it'll be worth it when you feel like a million bucks after finishing that well-balanced salad. Alright, it's almost time to chow down! While girls like Emily would love to order a pizza sometimes, they try to remember to eat healthy when they can. Even if that means settling for a monster salad on a Tuesday night. But if you are indulging in pizza for dinner, it just tastes better in front of the TV. And lucky for you, your roommate's not home, so you get this pie all to yourself. Oh yeah, come to mama! Get a load of all that cheesy goodness. Whoa, crust first? You're on fire, Olivia! Aw, look how happy she is. Face it, we all love shoes. But the question is, do you prefer comfort or style? Whether you love heels or tennies, you can still look totally fabulous, right girls? Take your time, Emily. You don't want to fall. For a lot of girls, one of the most trying times of the day can be deciding on what to wear. And for girls like Emily, there are sometimes too many options to choose from. Hmm. Whoa, there's a lot of colors to take into account here. Neither of these feel quite right. You often pick a color based on the way you feel that day. Ooh, what's this? Yep, today is definitely an orange day. Now that you feel fabulous, it's time to start off this beautiful day. Other girls, however, don't struggle as much with what color to wear. But that doesn't make the decision any easier. Let's see here. This black dress or this black dress? Yep, definitely this black dress. No matter what kind of girl you are, it's all about wearing what feels good and makes you feel happy. It's okay, Olivia. We know you're smiling on the inside. Amy, I'm not sure what to wear. Red or yellow? Amy, can you please help me? Yeah, sure. That one's fine. Come on. Come on. Yes, go! Amy! Fine, Bella. You asked for it. 100 layers of clothes. Fine. There you go, Bella. Now you don't even need to decide. You can wear everything at once. So heavy. Oh my god. This is so annoying. I should have just picked the red tank. It's getting so hot in here. And so stuffy. Ugh. Okay, come on. Let's do this. One more, and God knows how many more to go. Ugh, stretch! You can fit! I'm stuck. There you go, Bella. How you feeling under there? Cause you sure look plump all around. <laughs> I can't move. Must get air. And Dive! <laughs> Amy, take my hair out! It's getting pulled! Nope. Put it on. Nope. Bella. Fine. This is hard. I'm sweating myself. Really? <laughs> Amy! Ow! 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 Enough! I can't fit anymore! Yes, you can! Stretch out that arm! Come on, Bella! Push through! Jump! Stop pushing my face! Ugh. Okay. 
pants don't fit anymore. We can do hats. Yes. Hats. And one more. Wait, wait, wait. Don't move. Almost done. There. Great. We're done. No, no. Few more jackets. No, 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 no! Amy, stop! No, 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 no! Amy, stop! I'm actually going to tip over. I can't keep my balance anymore. And tie your bow. Ah, here, take these. They'll help your balance. Oh my god. I'm going down!